Hey guys, Hanserf92 here, and today I am going to be discussing why Ted Ginn Jr. is an overrated wide receiver in the NFL. Now, Ted Ginn is a very good punt returner, has lots of versatility, and has lots of speed. But at the same time, though, I really feel for a veteran wide receiver, he has a lot of rookie antics that need improvement. To start off, one of his main rookie antics is poor route running. Now, why does he get away with this? It's simple. It's because he faces against subpar cornerbacks. Now, when he runs his route, he's, he looks very undisciplined. And maybe that's because he has a very malicious running style. He really just doesn't run all that smoothly. He's still a fast guy, but technique-wise, uh, it's very subpar. And since... His routes are basically ran poorly. He struggles against top-tier cornerbacks. Now, he has some success against top-tier cornerbacks, but most of the time, he really kind of can get exploited against them. He's typically a burner who's really could just kind of just stretch the field somewhat, which he, he is good at, and he does that very well. But at the same time, though, you need to do more. You can't just get away with push-offs. You can't just do corny routes you can't like get open simply because the cornerback or the defensive back falls down the play he really needs to have um to have better overall technique when it comes to playing the wide receiver position and i really feel that for a nfl veteran he looks very very sloppy when running his my next point is i really feel that Ted Ginn Jr. has not really developed a real football IQ. Now, the reason why I say that is, is from this example. One time he was just running a route, and he got open. But once he caught the ball or was going to catch it, he was lunging his foot forward to the out-of-bounds mark, asking for an incomplete, uh, incomplete pass. It was a touchdown on the play, but at the same time, though, why he should be really be focused on his dis his feet discipline in trying not to step out of bounds. But he's lunging forward. It almost looked like he was trying to get out of bounds. And I and if you look at the play, he's you could really see his his running style that is just so wild. He was running pretty normally, but then his next like. His next step was just so lunged, and it was lunging toward the out-of-bounds mark. I really feel that NFL veteran would not make that mistake. Larry Fitzgerald, for example, who's been in the NFL, NFL for a long time, wouldn't, wouldn't even like risk that chance. Now, Ted Ginn did score a touchdown and did not uh, make it an incomplete pass. But at the same time, though... I'm not sure how long he could get away with some poor mechanics, especially for a runner who should be focused really on his own discipline. Overall, Ted Ginn Jr. is still a very nice football player and a very effective football player for the Carolina Panthers. Now, I really feel that the reason why not only he had success because he's faced against subpar cornerbacks, I also believe Cam Newton had an awesome season this year up until the Super Bowl. So overall, I would say Ted Ginn, he's still an overrated player in my eyes, but I really feel that he, the re main reason is because he really hasn't developed a true, true veteran mechanics whatsoever. All right. So thanks for watching the video. Please rate, comment, subscribe. See ya.